welcome to Tea with Jan. I am Jan. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you're new here, welcome. We talk about all things tea, whether that is tasting tea or looking at teaware, new and old. I love vintage teaware. If you've been around for a while, thank you so much for continuing to join me. And I'm excited to bring to you today's teapot for Teaware Wednesday. Boom! <laughs> this is a magnificent new teapot. I love it for so many reasons. I love the shape of it. I actually thought it was going to be a bit smaller when I saw it online and I completely fell head over heels in love with it. It is like everything that I love in a product. And Jeanette actually surprised me and gave this to me early for our anniversary. Now, I feel like we have two anniversaries. We have the anniversary that is the public one when we got married. <laughs> and then we have the a secret anniversary. Not a secret, it's not a secret. I guess it's just one that, you know, most people don't hear about. Most people think of your wedding anniversary and that that's what you would celebrate. And um, yeah, we celebrate that as well, but we also celebrate our date anniversary. <laughs> so that is just around the corner. And this is what she got me. So I mean, how am I gonna top this? You guys, you need to help me out. Help your tea girl out. So what is this, you might be asking? That's a good question. <laughs> Let me get some papers, some, something so I can read. Hold up. When you first look at this teapot, it looks like that traditional like white teapot with blue on it, with like, you know, just the, the prints and stuff. It's when you get up close that this teapot just speaks to me, like, and you know, perfect timing. Thank you so much, Jeanette. This teapot is called Things Could Be Worse. So it says, lost your keys, lost your job, look at the bright side. At least you're not plagued by pterodactyls, pursued by giant robots, or pestered by zombie poodles. Life is good. <laughs> The Things Could Be Worse tea service is designed to go with your calamity wear, dinner wear, and to remind you of how lucky you are. So it says that it's fine porcelain and in-glaze decoration, food safe, microwave safe, and dishwasher safe. Designed by Don Moyer, USA, produced and decorated at the Kristoff Workshop in Poland. Special thanks to the Kickstarter sponsors who made this project possible. I remember seeing the things could be worse stuff on Kickstarter. I think I saw the mugs first. I love Kickstarter. Ugh. To discover more beautiful utilitarian and funny products, visit calamityware.com. It is adorable. I love it. I love it. Now it should be noted that it came in this box. Like, it was delivered like this. So I think Jeanette was thinking, or I would have thought, that you would open up this box and then you would have this, you know, spectacularly decorated box to open up that would say a lot about it. But it's actually not. It was cradled right in there, which is great for environmental, like, you know, that that's spectacular. Just, I guess, not what we're used to seeing. So if you were trying to give this as a gift, please know that that's how it would be. You'd be, you'd be giving it kind of like that. So. All right, so the lid has the little catch to keep it there. Inside it has, you know, a fair amount of room. I can't remember how much this is. I'm gonna say like six or eight cups. Like it's a hefty teapot. On the bottom it says, things could be worse. Calamity Ware, 2018, made in Poland. And it has the little bug on the bottom. Now I don't know, like I, I love that it's different on both sides. I was kind of like, Jeanette was shocked that it was different on both sides. She thought it was the same print, just reprinted. But I love that they did that on both sides. So I don't know which is my favorite little monster or, you know, 
Demon of Doom. The Loch Ness Monster is pretty adorable. I love this giant crazy fish. Like, yeah, like the poodle that's like, looks like a demon is amazing. I love this. I don't know what that guy is called. A serpentine of some sort. It's just amazing. And then on this side we have, what's that guy called? The guy that runs through the forest. He's, you know, everybody's trying to find him. Not Waldo. He's in a store. What's that called? You know, uh, the big hairy guy. Come on, you guys. Ugh, help me out here. <laughs> Him, what's that called? Um, runs through the forest. He has big feet. Big feet. <laughs> Oh, and there goes all my energy. <laughs> uh, there's also a giant frog and just like, you know, the monkey. Like, I just, oh my gosh, I love the cat. It's almost like an eye spy. Like, it is spectacular. And then like when you look at the top, there's like little, you know, angry looking robots and stuff. It's just... I love it. I love that it's like, you know, oh, you know, grandma comes over for tea and you could be like, oh, we're going to use this tea set. And, you know, she's thinking that you're all classy. <laughs> and, and really, it's all like, you know, funny. <laughs> I love that. I love the double dutiness of it. It feels spectacular. Like, it feels like it's great quality. Um, I love that on the inside it does have, you know, like a little bit of a strainer for it. Um, I didn't find that there was any issues with drips or anything like that. I'll continue using it and see. It washed up like a dream. I didn't have any issues washing it. Um, it's, you know, big enough to get your hand in there and really give it a good scrubbing. And it just feels really nice. Like it, it's so smooth. It feels great. I'm just completely in love with it. I will link in the description down below to the website and you can check out his other wares as well. I know that he has mugs and then of course with this teapot, there was the optional cream and sugar. Um, I just really like teapots, <laughs> so yeah. And he has like different plates and stuff. And yeah, I'll link down below. It's so adorable. I love this stuff. I, I love it when it's like secrets. <laughs> it's so cute and adorable. I wanna know, do you guys love this? Or like, was this something that you would get? Can you just appreciate it from afar? Or are you like, holy man. And which little character do you love the most? Oh, they're so adorable. All right, I look forward to talking to you guys in the comments down below. Until next time, take care, bye.